بسم اللہ رحمان ابراہیم لیٹس بگن ود دا کوٹ آف دا ڈے لائف ٹیچز یو نیو لیسن ایوری ڈے اف یو آر اٹینٹو انف ان دا کلاس آف لائف آئی ایم ڈاکٹر آمنا خان ٹوڈے آئی بی گیونگ اے پریزنٹیشن آن دا ٹاپک انٹروڈکشن ٹو ایم سی ایچ اینڈ میٹرنل اینڈ چائلڈ ہیلتھ پروگرامس آئی بی پریزنٹنگ مائی پریزنٹیشن انڈر دی کائنڈ سپروویژن آف مائی آنریبل پروفیسر ڈاکٹر سائرہ افسل Today, the learning objectives are introduction of maternal and child health, aims of maternal and child health, sub-areas of MCH, activities of MCH program, need for MCH program, principles of MCH program, indicators of MCH program, recent advances, and MCQs. By the end of the presentation, the learning outcomes would be the participants will be able to describe introduction of maternal and child health, its aims, sub-areas, activities, and recent updates. Let's begin with an uh, introduction. Mother and children constitute a large group, but also vulnerable or special group. They comp- uh, comprise 71.4% of population of the developing countries. Children are the foremost priorities of community health program, and their aim is to increase the nutritional level of mother and children to ensure the birth of a healthy child. Mother and children, one unit. Child's health is related with mother's health. Healthy mother is healthy baby. maternal and child uh, development of um, maternal and social development of child is dependent upon mother definition the definition of maternal and child health is promotive preventive curative and rehabilitative health care of pregnant women before during and after delivery and uh, of infants and preschool school children from birth to 5 year sub areas of mch are maternal health child health family planning school health handicapped children adolescents health aspects care children in special settings such as day care now the mch to means are the women and the maternal health child health perinatal uh, infant health uh, the uh, adolescent health and children and youth with special health care needs the objectives of mch are uh, reduction of maternal perinatal infant and chi- uh, childhood morbidity and mortality a uh, promotion of reproductive health regulate fertility to have wanted and healthy children when desired provide basic maternal and child health care to all mother and children promote and protect health uh, health of mothers promote and protect physical growth and uh, psychosocial development of the children the ultimate objective is lifelong health components of mch are antenatal care intranatal care postnatal care infant care under five clinics immunization nutritional disorders and training programs and the health education infrastructure of mch includes the mch services are rendered through the infrastructure of primary health care and sub centers maternal and child health services are provided as a integrated package of essential health care also known as primary health care which includes principles of equity intersectoral coordination and community participation you can see the primary health care includes the four principles which are intersectoral coordination appropriate technology community participation support mechanism made available primary health care it makes available information about protection and resources for mother and ch- uh, child health care as per the recent taken in words a uh, world women's conference beijing 1995 maternal and child health services have been included in pr- reproductive and child health services now you can see the mch pyramid of health services which include infrastructure building services the examples are need assessment evaluation children and youth with special health care needs planning policy etc population based services examples are newborn screening let screening and so on and uh, enabling services examples are transportation translation outreach and the direct health care services for example basic health services and health services for the uh, children and youth for special health care and uh, with special health care and needs epidemiological aspects of maternal and child health the study of the distribution and determinants of health related status or events in mothers and children and the application of this study to the control and prevention of health problem problems related to mother and a child it follows systematic assessment of the health of the women in in reproductive age and children in the community including timely collection of data analysis interpretation dissemination and use of mch related data Ep- uh, epidemiological uh, tried uh, related to the mother and child it includes agent host and environment the agent is child 
फिटल लाइफ न्यूट्रिशन ग्रोथ एंड डिवेलपमेंट चाइल्डहुड न्यूट्रिशन फिजिकल केयर ग्रोथ एंड डिवेलपमेंट सोशलाइजेशन एंड केयर ड्यूरिंग इलनेस होस्ट इज मदर न्यूट्रिशन फिजिकल हेल्थ जेनेटिक इनहेरिटेंस एंड सोशल स्टेटस इन्वायरमेंट इंक्लूड्स फिजिकल बायोलॉजिकल एंड साइको सोशल एम सी एच प्रॉब्लम्स द ट्राइड ऑफ माल न्यूट्रिशन इन्फेक्शन एंड अनकंट्रोल रिप्रोडक्शन इफेक्ट द हेल्थ ऑफ मदर एंड चाइल्ड इन पाकिस्तान लाइक अदर डिवेलपिंग कंट्रीज नो यू कैन सी द ट्राइड हेयर विच इंक्लूड्स द न्यूट्रिशन इन्फेक्शन एंड द अनरेगुलेटेड फोटेलिटी थस मेकिंग द मटर एंड चाइल्ड हेल्थ केयर ट्राइड हेयर नो द एम सी एच प्रोग्राम The activities are maternal and child health care services, which are an important part of primary health care. Traditional activity areas of these program complete a uh, health checkup and care if the child and mother from conception to birth, studying uh, health problems of mothers and children, providing health education to parents for taking care of children, training to professional and assistant workers. Need for the MCH program. There are four main reasons why mother and children health must be given top priorities in a health program. Well, the first one is the mother and uh, child below the age of 15 years make up the majority of the population in almost countries uh, mo mother and children constitute a special risk or vulnerable group in the case of illness death in the terms of pregnancy childbirth of mothers and growth and development in the case of children by improving the health of mother and children we can improve the health of the family and community ensuring child survival is a future investment for the family and community indicators of maternal and child health maternal and child health can be evaluated on the basis of the following indicators the first one is maternal mortality rate below 1 second is infant mortality rate below uh, 30 for every 1000 live births then the third one is the death rate of 1 to 4 uh, old age groups below 10 fourth is size of family which is 2 to 3 members Five, uh, fifth is perinatal mortality rate 30 to 35 sixth is weight of minimum 90% of total children according to height weight charts recent trends in mch program Uh, uh the first one is the integration of care earlier mch care services were divided were divided into antenatal child care and family planning naturally it is helpful in increasing the cap capability and effectiveness of services number 2 is the risk approach this new thought was born from the lack of resources and their availability as per this uh, the risk group among mother and infant is identified uh, special care is given to them man power changes according to new concept maternal and child health services should be left to traditional health workers rather than specialists of file of the field and the child volunteers and workers of ngos guiding principles for the mch program consultation participation by families is uh, is integral uh, is integral to the services to meet the needs of young children and their families access and availability all families with young children should have access uh, the information services and resources that are appropriate for and useful to them primary prevention early detection of risk factors is required with appropriate intervention capacity building promotion of resilience and capacity is preferable to allowing problems to undermine health autonomy equity all children should be able to grow up actively learning healthy social sociable uh, sociable and safe irrespective of their family circumstances and background family centered the identification and management of child and family needs requires a family centered approach that focuses on strength inclusion Inclusive practices are essential for all children to get the best start, irrespective of their family circumstances, different abilities, background. Partnership. Quality services are achieved through integrated services delivered in partnership with other uh, early childhood and specialist services and with the family. Quality. All families with young children must be confident of the fam uh, of the qu quality of information, services, and resources provided to them. MCH uh, service program standard. Uh, the first one is the mch services provide universal access to the services for children from birth to school age and their families number 2 is the mch services promotes op uh, optimal health and development outcomes for children from birth to school age through the uh, through a focus on the child mother and family and the third one is the mch services builds partnership with families and communities and collaborate uh, collaborates and in integrated with other services and organizations the mch services are delivered by competent and professional workplace The MCH services are supported local government or the government authority provides a responsive and accountable service. Services for children, mothers, and families through effective governance and management. The MCH services deliver quality and safe services. A uh, complete health checkup and uh, care of the child of the child and mother from conception to birth. The studying the uh, health problems of mother and child, providing health education to patient uh, to parents for taking care to children. training to professional and assistant workers are the activities of the organization 
The background is that uh, the USAID's new maternal and child health program comprises of five major components which work through a public-private partnership mix, including the government of Pakistan, the private sector, the uh, philanthropic sector, non-governmental uh, non uh, organizations, local civil society, and community organizations. The components are family planning and reproductive health services, maternal, newborn, and child health services, health communications, health co health commodities and supplies, and health systems strengthening. MCH program in Pakistan is launched. Uh, it, it was launched. Uh, it launched the maternal, uh, neonatal, and child health uh, program in two thousand seven to accelerate progress towards Millennium Developmental Goals 4 and 5. Achieved uh, primarily through providing emergency, obstetric, and a newborn care services, training and development of a new cadre of community midwives, institutional strengthening, especially at the provincial and district level. Maternal, neonatal, and child health programs in Pakistan. Uh, National Maternal and Newborn Child Health Program 2006-2012 was launched national wide with a goal to improve uh, maternal, newborn, and child health of the population, particularly among its poor, marginalized, and disadvantaged uh, segments. Uh, the objective of the program will ensure progress toward achieving the Millennium Developmental Goals in maternal and child health. The core objective of the program are as under, uh, to reduce the under-5 mortality rate, the newborn mortality rate, the infant mortality rate, the maternal mortality ratio to 200 per uh, lakh life births. To increase the proportion of delivery, uh, deliveries attended by skilled birth attendants at home or health facilities to 90% and uh, the contraceptive prevalence rate to 55%. Uh, IMNCH and nutritional program. program. Uh, history and introduction includes it, uh, the, IR, uh, the IRMNCH and NP was launched in July 2013 with the strategy to integrate three different programs. LHW program, MNCH program, and nutritional program. From July 2000, uh, 2017, the CM Chief Minister's Stunting Reduction Program, and from June 2021, the Prime Minister's Health Initiative Program is also being executed by IRMNCH and National uh, Program, Nutritional Program. The objectives are to improve maternal health by decreasing morbidity and mortality by increasing the still birth attendance, uh, the skill birth attendance, the rural ambulance services, to increase the health timings and spacing of pregnancy and decreasing nutritional deficiencies. To improve child health by decreasing morbidity and mortality by increasing the essential newborn care services, increase new, uh, nutritional services, increase skilled birth attendance, and increase the ambulance services. And to improve the family planning services by increasing the contraceptive prevalence, increasing the postpartum uh, family planning services, and increasing the capacity building of healthcare providers. The components of the IMNCH and uh, the nutrition program are Lady Health Worker Pro uh, Lady Health Workers, the MCH program, CM uh, CM Stunting program, uh, PMHI program, Nutrition program, and the BHU's twenty four seven. Uh, now the conclusion is: Mother and child are one unit and most vulnerable to the morbidity and mortality. Hence, it is essential to protect them through appropriate actions at each level. MCH program emphasizes uh, the. Uh, analytical skills to address the health pro problems of the mothers and children through surveillance, assessment, planning, implementation, monitoring, and evaluation. Nurse as team members of the health can contribute her skills for the promotion of health of mother and children. Now the time for recent answers. Uh, I'll be talking about National VN 2016 to 2025 for coordinated priority actions to address challenges of reproductive, maternal, newborn, child, uh, child adolescent health, and nutrition. According to this, Pakistan is the sixth most pop uh, sixth most populous country, and uh, of the world, and sixty four percent of the population lives in rural areas. Sixty four percent of Pakistan's population lives in rural areas. Pakistan is experiencing thirty two percent of adolescents between ten twenty four years, which is the biggest cohort of the study of the history. According to Pakistan Demographic Health Survey two thousand twelve to uh, to two thousand thirteen, eight percent of adolescents women aged fifteen to nineteen years are already mothers or pregnant with their first child, and thirty five percent of women age 25 to 49, were married by age 18. Early pregnancy causes increase in morbidity and mortality in the in this age bracket. The most common reason of early pregnancy is early forced child marriages in Pakistan, and it has a correlation with poverty, literacy, and lack of understanding on sexual and reproductive health. Use of any contraception is 10% among marriage age 15 to 19 years, and only 6.9% of, uh, of any modern method. Uh, the... 
early uh, every newborn impact framework is as follows it has inputs outputs outcomes and impact the inputs includes the epidemiological environmental economical and social cultural leadership governance partnership and financing count every woman every newborn every child the outputs are the health workforce commodities health information system community empowerment and healthy home behaviors quality of care with innovation and the outcomes are the reproductive health care uh, the pregnant uh, the pregnancy care care uh, around the birth care of small or sick newborn postnatal care the universal coverage uh, every woman every newborn and every child the impact would be ending preventable deaths for women still births newborns and children improving children uh, child development and human capital who and maternal child health program WHO's reproductive maternal newborn child and adolescent health program provides technical support to health authorities at federal provincial and uh, area and areas level for implementing maternal newborn and child health strategies and programs every newborn an action plan to end preventable deaths the global every newborn action plan in app launched in 2014 provides a road map of strategic actions for ending preventable newborn mortality and stillbirths and contributing to reduce maternal mortality and morbidity uh every year 2.6 million babies die in the uh, in the first 28 days of life most in the first week the top causes are the prematurity severe infections and complications during birth but 75% of newborn deaths can be prevented with high quality care so can the majority of maternal deaths and stillbirths so healthy mother uh, would be health, uh, would give a healthy birth and then it would be uh, uh, giving good health in the first days of life which would which would be equal to the start of the healthy ch childhood launch of the every newborn action plan 2025 coverage targets and milestones moving faster to end preventable newborn deaths and stillbirths by 2030 was launched on 3 uh, 3rd september 2020 moving faster to end preventable newborn deaths and stillbirths by 2030 to uh, 2025 coverage targets and milestones so the objective is ending preventable newborn deaths and stillbirths by 2030 moving faster towards high quality universal health coverage in 2025 to Uh, 2022, uh, 22, 2025. In the document, INAP provides a roadmap to end the preventable newborn mortality, reducing disability, and end preventable stillbirths by 2030. The, uh, to guide countries in reaching their 2030 tar targets, INAP multi-partner initiative team, co-chaired by UNICEF and WHO, reviewed and updated coverage targets and milestones to guide progress between 2020 and 2025. The document also sets out new global, uh, national, and sub-national targets and key actions. that can be taken in partnership to accelerate progress now time for the mcqs let's start with the first one investigating in the health of women and children is a vital part of the right to health encompassing reproductive and maternal health perinatal and postnatal which of the following health services comes under the domain of mch uh, a nutritional intervention of women during pregnancy b tetanus toxicity application of uh, during pregnancy c treatment of hypertension in pregnancy D psychotherapy of women during a postnatal period E nutritional intervention tetanus toxicity application hypertension treatment during pregnancy and psychotherapy anyone A uh no that is E number 2 MCH is defined as promotive preventive curative and rehabilitative uh, health care for mothers and children the ultimate objective of F of MCH is A <clears throat> reduction of maternal perinatal infant and child morbidity and mortality b promotion of reproductive health c promotion of physical and psychological development of child and adolescent within the family d is promotion of lifelong health and e is promotion of the mental health a uh no it is a d the promotion of lifelong health number 3 in youth according to new strategy the mcs services is provided as the integrated package of essential health care Which of the following are according to the principles of primary health care? A. Community center, uh, center offering free, low cost checkups to everyone. B. Providing better education, uh, testing and treatment access to pregnant women in any community. C. Promotion of health sector in any community. D. Community mobilization and E. Community participation. Community participation. Yes. Um. This is just the one part. Uh, basically, it would be B. Providing better education, testing, and treatment access. to pregnant women in any community number 4 is maternal and child health services are provided as um, an integrated package of essential health care also known as primary health care which is the following is the sub area of the maternal and child health a family planning b uh, environmental health c occupational health d uh, mental health e maternal health a uh, yes a? it is 
uh, it is a family planning number 5 is in the xyz village of punjab the infant and maternal mortality rate is very high local trained birth attendants and lady health workers provide outreach com uh, counseling services to mothers with respect to prevention of diarrhea breastfeeding and weaning in uh, in home and also advice to go nearby healthcare if diarrhea becomes severe which type of mch services were taken into the account by lhw and tba a direct health service b infrastructure building service c enabling service d population based services e population based and enabling services e yes it is uh, e number 6 a, a public health a team wanted to start a health program in xyz community where they found that 75% of population is almost mother and child uh, below the age of 15 years there, there is also higher birth rates of newborn increased prevalence of low birth weight babies and high maternal and perinatal mortality for last few years which health program must be given top priority in health pro uh, program development in this community a health insurance program b community mental health program c school mental health program d universal immunization program and e reproductive and child health program e yes it is e seven xyz community faces a lot of maternal and child health problems and only uh, one health pro uh, program is running presently in the community and management team formed uh, that it becomes unable to run the program because of the resource co uh, constraints and funds which would be the best strategy to operate in the scenario a offering free low cost checkups to everyone stop the health program c adopt a risk uh, group approach including special care to mother and infant d adopt health high risk uh, approach plus partnership collaboration integration with other services and organizations for funding and e offering high uh, low cost checkups to everyone d yes it is d 8 an initiative to develop mch program in xyz urban area receive support from local local government community leaders and business owners key stakeholders are identified and contacted the main outcome for this mch program in evaluation metrics will be decreased maternal morbidity and mortality training and development of communities midwives st strengthening and uh, program management d improving the accessibility of high quality and effective mch services for all uh, for all the particular uh, particularly for the vulnerable and the poor disadvant uh, disadvantaged disadvantaged uh, community and e all a Uh, no, the answer is D. Ninth is in the X Y Z community, a public health team found an increase in the prevalence of under five mortality rate, neonatal deaths, low birth weight babies, uh, perpetual sepsis, and high uh, maternal mortality, which uh, is the most common cause of MCH problem problems in the scenario. Poor health service delivery, B lack of evidence based interventions, C malnutrition and infections, uh, and uncontrolled reproduction, D low female literacy, E high female literacy. A T C and yes it A. is the answer is C MCQ 10 according to um, according to about every newborn action plan and preventable stillbirths and newborn deaths by A 2023 B 2025 C 2028 D 2030 and E 2021 2025 no the answer is D here is the key of the MCQs and the references uh this is the youtube channel uh, please like and subscribe here thank you so much everyone for your time and your attention